President Muhammad Buhari recently signed the Constitution Fourth Alteration Bill into law. With this new law, all funds due to state assemblies and the judiciary will now be remitted directly to them and no longer through the state government. How will this move affect democracy and good governance in Nigeria? Financial autonomy for the judiciary and the National Assembly, I think that the Mr. President has done the need for. That is what our constitution stipulates. There will be that desired check and balances eh, between the various arm of government. And when that is done, it's going to enhance the performance of the organs of government and the desired dividend of democracy will be achieved in the, in the process. It's going to strengthen our democracy because the autonomy granted them will make them have more power to act as an independent arm of the government. I think they said that if the autonomy is being given to the state, the state will be able to operate on their own without any governor's interference. Then they will be able to make a genuine law that will benefit people at the grassroots level, especially the local government. With this development, state assemblies and judiciary would now operate financially independent like the National Assembly and the Federal Judiciary that do not rely on the executive for funding. Yeah, it has blocked so many things. You know, before now, everything has to go to the state, uh, to the various states. Before you know it, uh, the various people who are supposed to, various organs who are supposed to get what they are supposed to get, will not get it at the end of the day. But now that it's a direct route to every department or every organ of the government, it is the most important, it is the most uh, desirable thing for us to do. Because most of the governors have pocketed the legislators in their states, they can no longer do anything on their own except whatever the state government does. To help them, at least they can decide on their own. They can stand on their own and say no to the governor. When they see something that is wrong, they can say no to it. Give them this autonomy, that means they are free. Go and take whatever they want at any given time, whatever they want. Instead of being monitored for all, all these things, so they should be monitored properly. And uh, I don't think this one will help the government. That's not what we want. The others are not getting their salaries when it is due. They will be getting their own even in advance. Some development government directly. But the management matters. Meanwhile, concerns have been raised on the need for effective check and balances on the state lawmakers and judiciary to avert mismanagement of the funds. Neka Faithful Luke, Liberty News.